Hi there, Prayer Plant Girl here. Today uh, I received a package in the mail. It's this little uh, kind of multifunctional unit. So it has, um, it's a self-watering planter. It has a grow light built in. It's supposed to have a speaker. Um, I know that's an optional feature, so I'm not positive if this one has it or not. And uh, it has a humidifier and an air filter has a lot of things that are supposed to be going on in this little tiny unit. So it came in this box. So when I opened it up, it had, it had an instruction manual and some little pieces of foam, a little tip sheet, and this little kind of wick. It says it's silver ionized or something. Um, and then it had a power cable. Now I've added my own block. It says you need a five volt, five volt block with a two amp outlet. So I just found this one kicking around the house and it had these two little um, funnels. So there's like a little night light in here. One side has a night light or a like a reading light or whatever, like work light. One side has a grow light. They work independently of one another. So you can only have one on at a time. But in the top part here, you can plant a plant to grow. And then the bottom is the reservoir for the water for the uh, humidifier and uh, for the self-watering planter. So I've already put in, there was one of those little one of these little foam filters needed to go in the humidifier side, so I've already done that. Uh, and then take these filters out. So now you're supposed to take this little tray here, has one kind of larger hole off by itself there, and that's where this wick is supposed to go. So you're supposed to tie a little knot in one end of the wick and then put it through that hole so the knots on the top and the long straight parts down into the water. So it would go like that. So we don't need this part for right now. So once you have the wick in there, you're supposed to take this little, it's called non non-woven piece of fabric and put it in the bottom and that's just to keep any soil from falling through and then you can put soil in here and plant um, a plant. So I'm going to do that. Okay, so I've just planted this little hypoestes plant or hippo plant. Uh, this is just one that I brought in from uh, my yard when the weather started to cool down and I've had under grow lights um, in my house but I thought it's a very pretty plant a lot of people grow them for house plants and uh, it only needs low light to grow so I think it should do well even if this isn't a super strong grow light because I'm really not sure uh, so let's let's uh, put it in here and see how it goes so you're supposed to put that little wick down in the bottom and set this tray in and then this side is the funnel for watering the plants and you're supposed to just use like regular tap water so that's all I have here and there's a little water meter on the side here to see how full it gets so you can see how when it's full enough so you don't want to go past that meter. Holds quite a bit of water. It holds close to a cup and a half of water, which is quite a bit of water in that side. Now there's a fill port on this side, and that's if you want the humidifier going. And then you're also supposed to just use tap water or mineral water, I think it said. I would have to double check that, but it says not to use, not to use distilled water um, or anything that's not just uh, fairly much plain tap water. And then the little humidifier port is out the front here. So I haven't actually turned this on. Uh, 
I'm going to plug it in just to see if we get the light going and then I'm going to have to play with it a little bit to figure out how to get the uh, the clock and all that set. But there's a clock, there's supposed to be an alarm clock on it, all sorts of things. So it can be really interesting. We'll see how it works. I think you can time when the lights come on. So we'll just plug it in and see if we can get a light to work. Lights. Oh, there. Okay, so it's just like a touch, touch screen on the front here. So this is the plant light that's on right now, and I can see these little red LEDs, and then it looks like yellow or white LEDs. And then if you wanted just a reading light, you would turn it like that, and then this will angle so you could turn it to use it as a desk lamp. This must be the air purifier. Did I say there was an air purifier? There's supposed to be an air purifier on it. I don't hear anything. I don't know if I would though. No idea if it's purifying the air. Uh, and then that would be the humidifier. And I can hear it make noise, but I don't think I put enough water actually in it to, to use that. But let's turn the plant light back on for now. Like I said, the clock probably needs to be set. The date needs to be set. I need to play with it, make sure I don't have an alarm that's gonna come on or something. And I'll check if this one, uh, it looks like it has speakers, so it looks like I could Bluetooth some music to it or something. I'll have to play with that stuff a little bit more, but kind of a neat little product. So who was this, Ray Galax? I think that sent this out. I'll uh, try and find the link for uh, on Amazon and put it in the bottom down below for you so you can check it out for yourself. And once I've had some time to play with it a bit more, I'll bring you back and we'll we'll check it out a bit more together. But uh, for now, I just thought I'd show it to you. It's kind of an interesting little, little thing here. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye.